Life is a vapor. Nothing more than a raindrop into a sea that's deep in a weakened sea. But see me, I was never taught to swim. I was taught to keep all my thoughts above the rim. Yeah. And to this day, I still rep my city above my brim, above the brim. Because that sin sink deep in, we sink deep and we lose sight of that good reaper. Each day, the value of a child's life is cheaper. But we pay no mind to that good reaper, hit our people. And it's at that stage we begin to engage. But if you grab that good book, flip back a page when you were enraged, you see that God is trying to reach you, but you ignore that page. I mean, you ignore his page because you forgot the child were engaged. And now the things that we're engaged in has acting like caged men. You grab that good book and flip back to page 10, you see we were once great men. But now instead of acting like brave men, we conduct ourselves like caged men. In the history I'm talking about, you're going to find by taking a look into their history book because they took it out and they replaced it with fables for the round table. They did whatever they could to keep us safe by any means. They will take it before we were slaves, we were once kings and queens. And right now it's time for history to repeat itself. Now, I'm not telling you to put that history book on the shelf, but I am telling you, don't you read that without reading nothing else. I mean, do it for yourself. And if you're not going to do it for you, do it for the ones who come after you, because the children should not be the pride, because we did not tell them that God made us God's creators. That's why we have to watch and pray with our tongues, because today we are still being hung by each other. I'm trying to start a revolution, and let this revolution be televised. Let's let the world know we would not be the pride of our pride or of our rights. I'm not just talking about the Bill of Rights, I'm talking about the rights of life, the right to be free, the right to do right, the right to love, the right to do right, the right to love, the right to write, the right to read, the right to write, right? But first, we have to cover our family like a blanket covers the body. Covering your family is more of a duty than a hobby. And it's more important than the nine to five you can ever get, but it's amazing how when our nine to fives are easy get to cover our families. I'm talking to you. The one who's been given an insight to do what's right but still when night strike beneath your house of darkness as if somebody forgot to pay the light bill. why. Parents, whatever you and your spouse go on through it's time for you to end it and mend it because why y'all two been making where demons came in your house and they got like some thick right? That's right. Students, full time, A's, B's, I commend you, but right now there's a great task that you must send to. I need you to close that math book, open up that good book, check out that aftermath. What up, blood? What up, cuz? And those who gang bang just because it's time for us to grow up before our homes blow up. Right now, our hands are the only thing we need to throw up. I need you to stop going off road, get out that Ford, get in this Honda with the Lord, let's get over the court. Fathers, I need you to stop being a rolling stone and roll back to your home. Regardless of what the relationship is with the mother, if you can't be her lover, then you be her brother, brother. Prophets, pastors, teachers, the different that. Why you out keep the building? Who's building your children? I say Amber Alert. Amber Alert. Amber Alert. Amber Alert. You out so fishing your child's soul with missing. And the Bible says Jesus will leave the 99 to go after one. So why is it so hard for you to leave your congregation to go after your son or your daughter? Why is that so much hard? Mm. Praying grandmothers ain't too many of them left. Praying grandfathers ain't too many of them left. Praying fathers ain't too many of them left. Praying mothers ain't too many of them left. Real pastors ain't too many of them left. Real teachers ain't too many of them left. Real husbands ain't too many of them left. Real wives ain't too many of them left. Tell me who's doing right if everybody doing left. So we must cover our family like the blanket covers the body. Remind each other of the Genesis before the revelation. Because life is just.